So it looks like we're doing a cooking show. <laughs> <laughs> Five solo. I guess. There's kind of a lot of bottles. Uh, so this is mukbang with one pack of drinks. Hey! <laughs> mukbang. I need a drink. Same. Hello everyone, how are you doing? My name is Carmi and welcome back to my channel. I feel like I haven't done a main channel video in so long. I genuinely sit sat here just like having hanging out, you know, doing things. It hasn't been done. We've been busy, we've been traveling, we've been falling out, we've done so much. So today I thought it'd be good to basically speak about a couple of things. We're gonna be speaking about topics, questions, and drama that's happened throughout the past couple of years. We are quite honest on the internet, but we don't actually say everything that goes on because number one, we didn't want to get canceled, and number two, <laughs> I just ain't trying to get arrested! Like, for real. So we're doing a mukbang. Uh <laughs> We've got our snacks, got some alcoholic drinks. Me and Lewis are skinny, so. <laughs> We ate before. Mm -hmm. So did I. Baby. Oink, oink. <sighs> we are actually also pre drinking because we're going to Mirror Master's show tonight in central London, so that will be lit. So yeah, come enjoy a little couple pre's, a little bit of mukbang with us. And make sure you thumbs up the video and subscribe to my channel for more quality content like this. And without further ado, take your trousers down. Uh Nah, jokes. Well, Lucy's wearing a skirt, and I'm the only one with trousers. You wore a skirt to Prada the other night, how come? <laughs> Y'all did see, how come? I did break the internet. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see one repost. <laughs> didn't see one repost, one picture of nothing. I just saw you post it on Snapchat the other day, someone goes, yeah, Lewis wore a skirt. I was like, what? That's really offensive. <laughs> I, I feel bad for Lou. For what reason? Because he can express him, themselves as much as he wants. Is it because you scored it? Yeah, it's because I'm got it. <laughs> <laughs> We've literally had a sip of a drink. Was it killed? Yeah, baby. Oh. Oh. Baby was like on the floor, like ball gown. <laughs> Has the lighting gone bad? I don't know. Just go. It doesn't really matter. Okay. Makes it more authentic. Yeah, it, it's a nice vibe, honestly. Yeah, because y'all ain't got sunlight in your fucking face. <laughs> <laughs> Follow my IG, I asked you guys the questions on that, and if you want to get involved in our videos, go follow. Okay, let's start, let's start strong. Um, okay, let's go. Like <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's get to work. Um, <laughs> What happened on the last night of Kami's birthday? <laughs> you don't know too bad, wait, do you know? No. Nothing happened. They basically asked like, what happened between two people on the last day of my birthday. Nothing happened on the last day of your birthday. You're trying to be smart, but yeah, first. Let's just say two people hooked up and it's two people that you would never expect. Bang, her back doors in. <laughs> um, have you guys ever made out with each other? Do you want to tell the story, Kami? Yep. So we played a blindfolded kissing game and I was blindfolded and if anyone wanted some, they could come get some. So and I went and got some. It's about time. Is there a video of it? No, apparently not. There's a, there's a picture of me after the kiss, but I look kind of dusty. I might and you it. look giddy. He like <laughs> grinned ear to ear. Yeah, like. honestly. But I didn't know who it was because I was blindfolded. Who did I guess? Jacob. Oh. Yeah. Um, what's something we haven't told each other? I actually thought of this because like mine's quite recent to Lewis. Um <laughs> to Lewis. Yeah. Mukbang. Guys <laughs> 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 oh, have some. Ew. 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 Guys, I hoover. Have some milk. No, I can't. Anyway. Um <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's something that we haven't told each other? Well, you have one, so go. Okay, basically, we went to, we went to Marrakesh for Millie's birthday, and I was like to Lewis, he basically like piled all his clothes on the floor and was like, what should I wear? We were like, mm, all the clothes are ugly, and I was like, wait, Lewis, what shorts are they? And he was like, oh, they're like a, some designer brand. And I was like, can I have them? And he was like, no, so I just put them in my suitcase and I have them. <laughs> wait, actually. <laughs> yeah, the blue and yellow ones. <laughs> Have you seen him recently? I don't know, my shook is still ain't been packed, unpacked from that. <laughs> but it was three months ago. I have three full suitcases of clothes from Paris then and my other holiday. Just so I'm ready to go again. Yeah. You're such a jet setter. Uh, I don't have one. Yeah, me either. I probably think about it. I feel like we're a very, a very close group, but whenever something happens. Yeah, I'm straight away. I'm back as well, mm. but like still. Yeah, but I thought the, the short form was hilarious, so I thought I'd insert that one. Why don't we speak about Wabi Fell Out? Uh, Wave House era and Lewis ditched us for Olivia. And oh no, y'all ditched me. No, you ditched us. No, y'all ditched me. You had an option to join the Wave House yeah. and you didn't. And I said no. Yeah, and yeah. then. I'm trying to fuck her, dude! 
I mean, it still was pretty lit. Yeah, you, you know you missed out. No, baby. Yeah, baby. I'm really <laughs> glad I wasn't 22 years old running around the garden dressed as a Mario character. <laughs> well, I'm glad your friendship group's still going strong. Oh. <laughs> I'm she still close to other parties. <laughs> Like, girl, you got me too. Well, <laughs> 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 my puts a hat in the bag. My brother, run! Me fighting my demons. <laughs> <laughs> For real, I went to get one and I was like, you don't need that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. 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 Oh, he went soon, that's why he's <laughs> I thought best friend sounded cringe. Like. Okay, carry on. Um, so yeah, we were like, oh, we want Lewis to be in it. And then Lewis, like, he was in the calls. I cool. went to like two of those calls. But first of all, can we say when everyone, <laughs> everyone on those Zoom calls, because it was Corona, was introduced themselves. And Lewis literally came into a call and showed his face and did not say anything. They're like, so what's your name? And Lewis literally just <laughs> blanked. <laughs> His microphone was muted and his video was off. He switched that bitch off after like 10 minutes. And like, he was like, they were like, um, is Lewis still here? And we were like, like, motherfucker was nosy. But yeah, realistically, we did fall out for like, how many months was it? I don't really remember becoming friends again. Yeah, it was never like a serious fall out. Me and Billy were actually pissed. Because I remember ages ago in Alma Grove State, it was like four years ago, me and Billy were like, he would never ditch us for like a new group, right? And me and Billy were like laughing. We were like, he would never, and you literally just ditched us. No, because you guys moved out of London and had full time jobs. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, Lewis moved to. Can we talk about the fact that Lewis moved to. Yeah, and like knowing that he'd be close to us and the second that he moved, we moved to Ealing. Yeah, we moved, right? Because Lewis is so cryptic and like didn't express his feelings. He never told us that that was why he moved. There wasn't an oath sole reason, but it was a main reason. Yeah, so then if he told us that we would have like stayed in the area-ish. Like, really, can you pull up that curtain down? Because look at my face, I have like a glow on me. Okay, go do it then. It, bitch, it's my house, but you can like put a curtain down. So we didn't technically fall out, but I just know when me and Billy were in the wave house, we did not speak. Uh-uh, and then you guys had a party and didn't invite me, but invited my best friends. I don't remember Olivia. that. Olivia. Olivia. Yeah. What era is this? This was like mid or <clears throat> Uber. The 2020? I went through my because I went through my memories and there's like a Polaroid of like us, Olivia and like Ali. Oh. And I'm like this is weird. Oh yeah, no, because I remember that's how we got back being friends with Lewis because we'd meet up at the motives all the time. It just that was the only time we'd really see him was when we were like messed up at these motives. Yeah. And then we'd like ex pour our hearts out to each other. No. And we'd be like, I miss you, baby. I don't think you guys yeah. had joined the wave house at that point. Yeah, we had to come home on the weekends. Oh. Do you know what I mean? Work oh, yeah. 9 to 5 Monday to Friday and then come home on the weekends. Um, yeah. So yeah, we fell out, we made up, we fell out, we made up. We would never actually fall out. We're too similar. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah, I feel like stuff. all of our free humans are so unmatched. <laughs> actually. Like, cause you know how we would like with other- <laughs> <laughs> Was that an inside joke? No, we No, we do not have inside jokes about you. Yeah. Anyway, um, no, we actually don't. I was gonna say, <laughs> shut up, bitch. I was gonna say, who do you think is funniest in the group? Lewis. <laughs> I'd say humor-wise, me, like no, Lewis, no, no, your humor's like not funny. It is hilarious. It's kind of like a bit not egotistical, narcissistic. And I don't want to say it, but someone said it. So. Right? He says he invented sarcasm. <laughs> he we literally said love. I genuinely invented it. Like, how do you think it became a trend? And it's like no offense, but Millie the most unintentionally some... funny. Thank like you. Like this bitch can walk down the stairs and I'm wheezing. Like, <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> Rudest TikToker such influencer such celebrity you ever met. Oh my god. I have one. BB Rexa. <laughs> We were actually that? talking about that the other day. Who the fuck is Zara Larson? Zara Larson. BB Rayner. Like all these. BB <laughs> Rayner. <laughs> All these people, like Sam Smith even, no one's like, who's your favorite artist? They're like, oh, BB Wiener, or like Sam Smith. Like, no one says that. Like, these are industry plans. That's no, yeah. really mean, Millie. Nah, I'm sorry. By the way, like, if you well, have Well, who the fuck's favorite artist is Millie T? Check my Spotify. <laughs> to be fair, Sam Smith is 110% the rudest person I ever met because when I saw him on the street, I went up to him like two, three years ago and I was like, I just compared to him and it made me feel sick. Oh my god, do you remember that what we always used to my say? Day. Can't we look like that? Nah, nah, nah. I, I forgot this. about that! Either way, when I saw Sam Smith walking down the road, I was like, Oh, hi, um, I do YouTube and look people in my comments said that I look like you. He looks at me up and down and spits in my face. And I was like, what the fuck? And he walked away. And then you woke up. Yeah, who's yours, Mel? The Bieber X, sir. No, um... Look, the baby. Oh my god, so... No Mosey. She is, like, stunning. Like, stunning, stunning. She's called... <laughs> She was weird to me at first anyway, like weird energy, like, you know when you meet girls it's like competitive energy straight away, but like, I don't have time for that, so I was just like, what, like, is going on? She was trying to get with one of my friends, like, massively, and I think she then started trying to use me as a way in, um, no, um, and Jewish, um, and then, um, so she was being nice to me, didn't see her for ages, saw her at an event, and I'm like, hi, and she's like, hi, 
speaking up to me, he turns away and carries on speaking to a friend and I'm like, what the fuck? And I'm stood there. Oh, I just stayed stood there and then I just like tapped her and I was like, hi. And then, yeah, but it's just like bitchy energy. But then it was like, fine. You? I don't think I have one. You definitely do. I, I don't. What about No. <laughs> She like, wasn't rude. Y'all hated her though. Uh, yeah, she was jarring. So would you not pass it? I, um, that wasn't rude. The one below was most annoying TikToker, so obviously you'd say her. No, I have someone else for most annoying. Who? El that girl who does the TikTok shop. Eloise? Yeah. <laughs> nah, um... <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, no, I know, but I genuinely can't say this girl. I haven't even seen I, her. I've never seen her before. Oh my god, do you know who does annoy me? And please do not put this in karma, because I, I feel bad even saying it out loud when he's catching the SD card, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I like her. Yeah, because the boys all fancy her, but it's like when I when I spent time with her and like saw her, I saw her filming this TikTok and stuff, and I was like, it is actually like the biggest pick me energy I have ever ever seen before. And usually I'm like not even like that faced by pick me energy. I'm like oh whatever, but like just the stories I heard afterwards were afterwards as well that she did to people. Oh yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. That was what it was to me. It's like fine, but the other people I was like oh damn, like she was so nice to me and fine, just like her energy. Actually, don't put that in. That's really bitchy for me. Don't actually put that yeah, in because yeah. I don't actually mean to. It's not. Like, oh, I don't know. You ask me a question. So I answer. You ask, I deliver. I explained your last sex story. <laughs> mine was rogue. I don't really want to explain mine. So why would you ask the question? I want to hear yours. I, mine, I don't know. I'm in a relationship, so I don't really remember. The last time y'all had sex. No, as in like, <laughs> it, it wasn't like a, like a vivid memory. <laughs> <laughs> You, you so, get what I mean. No. You were in a relationship for four years. You remember every single time. The last sex story you had. So like y'all had sex that she like whatever and you don't remember it. Well like there's no story to it is what I mean. Days, months, weeks. That's weird. I can't really remember. But y'all had sex in months. No. <laughs> what about you, Billy? Uh just smack around the bedroom. <laughs> oh I know, I know, I know what happened. Really? I was there. Not not saying that it was me, but I was there. Yeah. You 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 enjoyed the show. Oh, I got a little sum out of it. Uh, <laughs> Not like that, but no, like, because afterwards, tell me why Carmi was going. And it's my birthday. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> no, Denise. It was triggered. You said it. No. It's funny. It's funny. I'm not gonna believe you. Don't ever Basically. try to get blame me like that again, and like you think that I'm gonna believe your shit. What was your last one? Um. <laughs> Ew. I, oh, the fan he DM. No, it wasn't like that. Um, I no, haven't. I've never. Like cheesy fucking quizzy <laughs> yeah. Dorito. -y it's breath. more original. Yeah, I've never had sex like like as in like with <laughs> another person. Well, I was enough, thinking you've about never it. had sex with another person. No, like just done everything else, not sex. No, like, with, with like my ex, we never had sex. Um, and that's not true. Remember the time when you bled? Yeah, that banjo got snapped up a lot. <laughs> I think I tried to do it. It never worked. You couldn't get hard. You, no, yeah. Motherfucker came after it in one minute. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Millie, you stop telling everyone! You said you were gonna tell anyone! Three pumps and dump! <laughs> Three pumps and dump! Pump busted. and dump! Pump. Yeah, that One is. pump! To and random dump. girls, it kind of is the energy. I am single, by the way, my DMs are always open, and not enough sexy bitches are in my DMs at the moment. Uh, and if you're not trying to snap him up after that, motherfucker will just snap his banjo instead. Nah, I need to lose my virginity, so if anyone is out there and wants to take my virginity, I literally, I don't mind. Um, shut up. You shut up, bitch. You want Shag the club dancer? We didn't end up shagging. No, she sent him a link to a therapist and said you actually need ah! therapy. And sent him a link to a fucking psych psychiatrist. It's because, yeah. She actually did. <laughs> no, she actually did, yeah, but I kind of like that. Was like, she was like, you genuinely need Yeah, in hindsight, help. that was kind of funny. Yeah, first person, huh? I was like, slay, bitch. Like, I, I'm a, wait, what she look like again? Because I'm a CNS, I'm a She fit, to be fair. Why do you? She actually has a baddie. I mean, you've got to be a baddie to be a dancer, right? Is it awkward hanging out with Lewis with him being gay? I do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's awkward oh. because <laughs> what someone asks. I don't think it's awkward because obviously why the fuck are we gonna judge him? I wouldn't say it's awkward. No, it's just. <laughs> 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 oh, <what? laughs> yeah, y'all remember now. <laughs> when we... Don't say we. <laughs> I was never brought into this. He literally said y'all. No, you. Yeah, you said y'all. I said you. What do you count? This is a... like. <laughs> <laughs> so you've just done a say out with yeah, right? this guy that has questions. Oh, Carly, can you send me a picture really quick so I can put it on my story? <laughs> me you. I asked you. I asked you an hour ago. Most incestuous thing that's happened in your friendship group. It has to be everyone just getting. I have never kissed anyone. You definitely kissed Millie no. and then Morris. I have a video of us kissing. <laughs> Not you properly. Mm. I probably pecked Millie. No, we're drunk in the club. I have a video and we go like this. We go. Like... 
Ugh. And then they get each other's tongues. Bop, bop. Bop, bop, we're getting some in the club. Have you ever been gaslighted? Probably by you. Yeah, you're such a gaslighter. Oh, my gaslighter. You'll, yes. get, you'll gaslight us into like um, ordering for something or going to like picking you up from something. Oh, yeah, but, that's so different. Yeah, but that's still fucking gaslight. But you'll say no to it and you'll be like, are you fucking joking? Like, oh my god, like, like, like what the fuck? And they're acting like this tiniest like thing is the biggest deal ever. It's actually kind of fucking toxic. You should you should really look at that. Yeah. Practice, like. <laughs> yeah. You think I'm a bigger gaslighter than Ben Morris? Well, he's not in the room, but. Also, that's is. gaslighting, bringing someone else. Yeah. In. Right. Like, take accountability. Right. And the way that you treat people can be life changing for them and can really scar them. What about you never admit when you're wrong then, bitch? Because what? I'm always right. What? See, this is what I mean by narcissism. It's not It's not a good look and it's really unattractive. You've gone from a six to a four. So you're scared. <laughs> what about when I was outside your house once crying and you never let me in because you were fucking busy with a boy? That never happened. <laughs> Literally <laughs> lies. That's not even gaslighting. That's just a pure lie. Shut your dumb ass up. Bitch. Shut up. You're lying. You should never call a woman dumb. Why? Because all women have good qualities. Um, what's our funniest drunk story of all us being together? I can't help but just say what happened the other night. Yeah, but you can't promote that. Maybe when we had a house party in Longley House and Millie was fucked up and like, she, the bitch was just vulnerable and just like she lost her phone, her door handle like fell off, she couldn't get in her bedroom, it was hilarious. And Lewis, can we talk about the time that we well, you had a party? You got too much. No, like, wait, this is true. Move on. We now. had a house party and we set up a Ringo camera that's supposed to go outside, you know, see so you comes in and out of the house, and um, connects to an app on our phone and we put it on the stairs and was like, no one's coming up the stairs. Everyone at the party ended up going up the stairs, we accepted it, the camera was still there rolling. Lewis goes up the stairs, he knew they was recording, which is the most fucked up thing about it. He takes it off, undoes all the cellar tape, puts it on the floor, looks us dead in the eye, and just stamps on it, and the whole thing just goes. I was in a really dark place, actually, so that's really toxic that you bring that up. <laughs> I feel like you project. shouldn't project. Yeah. Like, oh my god, so you see, that's just projecting onto me. You should speak to your friends instead of being aggressive towards them. You always just hit, and you hit me the other day in Morocco, you kept smacking me around the head. Maybe you deserved it. Oh, your dress was old, Polly, though. What? <laughs> you might, you, 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 when we went to Wireless in 2019, and <laughs> oh. Ew, what the f I feel like it's gonna involve me. There was a <laughs> everybody basically, I don't know what happened. Like, crowds were running out of Wireless, like, stampede. No, they thought there was no, gunshots. Yeah, so everyone thought there was a gunshot or like knives or bombs or something was going on. When I, like, I'm not just talking about a couple of people running out, like, hundreds and hundreds yeah. of people were like sprinting, screaming. So we were all running. As we're running, we see Millie. Wait, my team. camera, my camera, my camera. Go. As me and Carly are sprinting out of this festival, Insane. we see Millie like stumbling like on the opposite direction of these hundreds of people sprinting out. We're screaming like petrified, like Millie, Millie, like we need to go. And Millie goes, "Where's everyone going?" We're like, "We need to leave." And she goes and looks and goes, "Ah, oh, the drinks queue's so short right now." <laughs> through the crowd and towards the drink. She is the scattiest bitch I ever come across. Did they die though? Prior to that, I chucked mayonnaise all over her. And then we went back to Yeah. House. Oh, and then you burnt Spencer's like designer jacket. Oh, it was oh. an Ikea blanket. Yes. Spencer does this thing, right? He had an Ikea fucking blanket and we like burn it and put barbecue sauce on it. So me and Lewis were fighting or whatever, like trying to set it on fire. I'm not really sure what was happening. Then Spencer's like, Oh no, my nan got me that like really? half <laughs> It was for like here and it was four pounds. Thomas of them all. Okay, right. No, you just used me. Oh. Mm-hmm. And you're welcome, bitch, because you'd be hella bored if I wasn't around. I thought you were gonna say broke if I wasn't around. I was like, boy, <laughs> don't even. Don't even. Not your poopy. You went there when it was one mil plus reacting to music <laughs> Right. Yeah, oh right, yeah, I got that. I'm done here. Same. <laughs> What if you guys want to carry on this conversation here with my channel Yeah, we did like a three-way collab to be fair So this it's is the start It's kind of like 2014 YouTube I like it We're gonna get progressively more drunk in mine and Lewis's videos as well So it's, so it's gonna be even more funnier and even better So if you start on this video, <laughs> the best you Sorry! That was our video, make sure you follow me on Instagram I'm actually a Snapchatter now, I'm literally all over that So go add me up on there and I'll catch you in my next video Bye!